Want to start using X, but not sure how it works? We're here to help. I'm Jessica, and this video is our beginner's guide to X, where I'll teach you all the basics of using the app. Now let's get started. If you haven't installed the X app yet, check out this video to learn how to get it. Once you have the X app installed and have set up your account, this is what the X app homepage looks like. The For You feed will feature trending posts and post X things you'll like based on your activity on the app. The following feed will feature posts and reposts by people you follow. To find people to follow, tap the search icon in the menu at the bottom, then type in their name in the search bar at the top. Tap People. When you find the profile of the user you want to follow, tap Follow to the right of their username. That user's post will then appear in your X following feed. There are a few different ways you can interact with other users' posts. You can tap the heart icon to like a post. Tap the message bubble icon to reply to a post. Tap the rotating arrows to repost it to your own feed, or quote the post and add your own thoughts before reposting it. The number on the right side is the number of views this post has. To share a post, tap the share icon. Then you can share it in a direct message or to another social media app. To share your own posts on X, tap the plus sign in the bottom right corner. Then you can type in what you'd like your post to say. To attach a photo or video, tap the photo icon. Then select an image from your device's camera roll. Tap the camera button to snap a new photo or video to share. You can also use Grok, the XAI tool, to generate a new image based on a description you provide. To add a fun animated GIF, tap the GIF icon. Then you can browse popular GIFs or search for something specific. Tap a GIF to add it to your post. To run a poll through X, tap the poll icon. Then you can add a question and up to four options for people to vote between. You can choose how long you want your poll to last by tapping poll length. You can create a thread of multiple posts by tapping the plus sign. This will add another post in your thread. You can also choose who's allowed to reply to this post. When you're ready to share your post or thread, tap Post in the top right corner. You can see your own posts by going to your X profile. Tap your profile icon in the top left corner then select Profile. Here you can see your past posts, replies, highlights, media, and posts you've liked. You can customize your profile by tapping Edit Profile at the top. X also has a place to browse trending topics and news. If you tap the magnifying glass icon, you can browse topics for you, trending topics, news, sports highlights, and entertainment. If you tap a topic in one of these categories, you'll be taken to a feed of posts about it. The icon in the middle of the bottom menu takes you to the Grok AI. Here you can ask questions, generate images, and more. If you've used other AI platforms like ChatGPT, Grok works very similarly. If you tap the bell icon, you'll be taken to your notifications section. Here you can see interactions with posts you've shared and updates X thinks will interest you, as well as posts you've been mentioned in. The Verified section is specifically for notifications from verified accounts. The last section is for direct messaging. Tap the envelope icon to get to this section. Here you'll see a list of conversations you've had with your friends on X. You can start a new conversation by tapping the new message icon in the bottom right corner. Now type in the name of a user you want to chat with. If you'd like to create a group chat, tap Create a Group. 
Then tap the names of the users you want to add to the group. Tap Done to begin your conversation. Once in your chat, you can type in messages to send and attach photos, videos, and voice notes just like you can in posts. Tap the heart icon beside a message in your chat to react to it with an emoji. You can also share posts to these chats. That does it for our beginner's guide to X. To learn more about using X, check out our full playlist of X tutorials. Click the playlist on your screen now to watch. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you'd hit the like button below and subscribe to our channel. We put out great new tech tutorials like this one every day.